A dire student housing situation almost forcing one GTHA family to take unorthodox measures for their son. American Natividad in Caledonia, where the parents of a University of Guelph student say rent for off-campus housing is so high, their son was ready to live in this van while going to school. He's got it hooked up to a bunch of little lights. I don't know if you can... Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is what Melissa and Jim's son would have called home while attending classes this year. It's a converted van the couple regularly uses for camping adventures. Their son has since found an actual room to rent, but Melissa says up until about a week before the start of the school year, this was the plan. It's in couch mode right now. It pulls out into a full queen size bed. You said the little desk area you were going to put. Yeah, so I would have taken it and cut it off at about here. So his bed would have gone this way. Okay, yeah. And then he could sit here with a little desk here. And I would have taken that seat out there and then put in a little spot for cooking area, little fridge, 12 volt fridge. And he could live in there quite comfortably. A combination of OSAP, scholarships, and money from a summer job helped their son stay in residence in his first year. This year, however, the housing situation was tougher. I'm thinking maybe, you know, 550, 600 for a room. Um, but they were not. Uh, anything if you wanted fairly close to the university was going to be at least 850 or more for plus, something plus decent. Bills. Plus yeah. the bills on top of that. Mm -hmm. So you're like, you're getting up there $1,200, $1, $1,400 by the time, you know, months, months done. Right. So it's just out of it. So how did the van become the best option as opposed to commuting? He goes, mom, pops, I cannot give up that time and commute. Last month, Melissa took to Facebook to find someone who would be willing to rent out a parking spot to her son and inadvertently caused a minor online commotion. Did you think it would cause as much of a stir as it did? No, no, no not, no. <laughs> not <laughs> Absolutely at all. Absolutely not. At first I was like, is this for real? But mm -hmm. then all of a sudden the screenshots of the uh, parents that were asking for a parking spot started to come my way. According to the latest rent report from rentals.ca, the average price for a one bedroom in Guelph is $2,023. A two bedroom, $2,396. It ranks as the 12th most expensive city for rent in Canada. We need more supply of housing, all types, including student housing as well. The building sector, the development sector has a role to play, but so do universities and colleges as well. We reached out to the University of Guelph. In a statement, a spokesperson said the school is developing a student housing strategy to plan for the future. Quote, this strategy includes assessing the available student housing supply, examining our Guelph campus and residence buildings in terms of expanding spaces, and completing a student housing market demand study. The spokesperson adds that a report with recommendations will be available before the end of the year. In Caledonia, Erica Natividad, City News.